What is cache memory? Hmm. Hey guys, my name is Devan Chu and you are watching Tech Loop. And in this video, I will be talking about what is cache memory and I will be telling you why is it important for you. What are you Before explaining what is cache memory, let me clear one thing. It is called cache, C-A-C-H-E, not catch or cache. It's called cache memory. For those of you who are pronouncing it wrong. Cache memory is a memory storage part on your CPU or processor. Now many of you must be thinking why there is a need for memory part on the processor. But let me explain it in this way. Suppose your mobile has a 1GB RAM and it runs on 700 MHz and you have an octagon processor which runs at 2.3 GHz. So you can see the difference in the speed of the RAM and the processor. So when you give some tasks to the CPU like opening a web page or any software, CPU processes the order and give it to the RAM and says the RAM that give the output as fast as possible. But the RAM is too slow as compared to the CPU, so CPU has to sit there for a while to obtain the output from the RAM. So the processing time which can be used to perform some task is wasted to wait for the output by the RAM and the mobile starts to lag. So to save that processing time, the manufacturers have given a small fast storage part on the CPU or processor so that the when required, the data can be taken from the cache memory when you want to process it very fast. But many of you may be thinking why manufacturers don't make RAM out of this cache memory. Let me explain this in a way. So when you go to Amazon to buy a pen drive, you can notice that two pen drives of same capacity and from same manufacturers have different prices. So the difference in that price range are affected due to the speed of the pen drive more the speed the pen drive is more expensive so you can understand this that cache memory is too fast so it is very expensive to build ram out of this cache memory and if they do so many customers will refuse to buy these expensive mobiles or gadgets and this is also the reason why manufacturers like snapdragon gives only 4 mb of cache memory on their processor now you may be thinking what 4 MB can do when we have gigabytes of storage. So let me clear this one that the cache memory doesn't store any program or any software. It's just store the important part of this software or app. So if you are running an app that has a large template like Facebook, the cache memory stores its template. When you want to open the app, it processes the uh, template very fast and you can see the template first then the content you may have noticed that when you open the Facebook app you first be presented with the template and the second thing you see is the content and that's the work of the cache memory it processes the data very fast so it holds some data or a set of data or any set of object in its storage place once again I must clear this Cache memory doesn't store any software or any program, it only holds some important part of it. Now I hope you have understood what is cache memory and what is the use of cache memory. But if you still have any questions, you can leave that questions in the comment section. And if you think this video deserves a like, please do so. And you can visit my channel if you want more videos like this from here. And thanks for watching and you are watching Check you. What are you jumping?